morning, um, I'm out on the canal again. It's a bit rainy today, but never mind, it'll keep people at bay. Uh, back at a location where I was with Richard, just like to give a massive, massive shout out to Nigel and the North Fans Magnet fishing team. Thanks for the boost, mate, on YouTube. Uh, also, your videos are cracking, guys, it's mental. Uh, possibly meet up with you one day. Uh, I'd like to give a big shout and a thank you to all my new subscribers um, and let's get them videos going. So like I said, we're back to where Richard and I was the other day. Uh, I'm not revealing the location. I believe it to be quite full in here. Um, thank you to PB Metals for collecting all the scrap and I'll get back to you soon, folks. Let's get clicking. Bicycle pump, but not coming straight. Do we get a squirt? No, it's broken. Squirt. Oh, yeah, look. Squirt, squirt. That was a bit of a goof up, wasn't it? Oh, it's landed straight on something. <laughs> Come on. I think we'll find that with a wheelbarrow tyre. Can find it again. I'll probably get it in a minute. No doubt. What have we got here? Part of the digital weighing scale. Tim Tam. Found a good old cassette there. Up in these videos are on angle now. How on earth? Oh, it's got a metal screw in it. Yeah. Cool. Baby, don't let me down 220. I can feel it. Wow, that's heavy. Whatever it is. Don't let me down 220. Come on, magnet store, bring me baby. What on earth? Oh my god, that's heavy is that. I'm gonna have to get flat magnet on it. I got it right to edge from the other side guys. Let's see what it is, eh? Let's get this big Wukong out, see if I can pull it up with that. Because uh, as I got it to edge, it was just too heavy. But that 220 just pulled that. 
from right over there, folks. <sighs> Bloody hell, that scared me to death. There's a glove in water there. I thought it was somebody's hand. Jesus Christ. Is somebody having a giggle upstream? That nearly made me poop my pants. I hope you could see that, folks. Little glove with hands sticking up out of water. That just absolutely made me crap my pants. Friggin' hell. <laughs> hey, let's get on with finding this. <laughs> See what we got down here. It's something big, folks. I can feel it. There we go, right on it. Oh. Let's see if we can get a good bit of it. Right. Let's get based on it as well. I can feel it clicking, but it's not just picking it up. So I'm on it anyway, I'll get based on it. Why not use them all, eh? Come on, baby, don't let me down. Oh, I've got me on magnet. Yeah, that bloody snap then. Get off. See what we got. Damn on it. Oh, him base struggling. Get on it. Jesus Christ, look at that. Massive box. And guess what? Magnet stores 220 drag that from over the other side. You've seen it yourself, folks. Go buy one. Thought that was my first phone for hooks. Decent one, but it's not. No mind her. Nice one, folks. Got a little basher. Nokia. Cool. Nice little hammer there, folks. Cool. There we go, folks. Tap shoe. <laughs> They're not great tappy, are they? Them ones are though, look. Look at that, cool tap shoe. Oh, it's got a name on it. Express. Cool. Look that up, folks, eh? We have a mystery bag, folks. Let's have a look. Oh! Padlocks. Ooh. No name visible. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's got all pins in it. Gee. Yeah, just careful with that one. And I can see them all there. Just sat there like that. Wow. 
Wow, that was fortunate. We have a whoa, whoa, I love that watch, folks. Cool. Wow, go watch. What else have we got in our mystery bag today? We've got a battery lead, <laughs> a battery, another battery, another battery. Uh, looks like a sewing cog. Another padlock, another padlock. Another battery connector by the look of it. Last bit, no needle. Another needle. Another needle. <laughs> oh, a few needles on here, folks. So what else have we got? We have a key. Does the key fit the padlock? Can we have another key? Wow. Mystery bag with contents. And there's a lovely key there as well. Right, I'm just going to wang that in my bucket, mate. And we go. Put my treasure in my book, in my bucket here, folks. I'm just gonna do a sweep of here and make sure there's no needles about. There we go. If there's any needles about, they're on there. I don't know what that is. A jelly eyeball, no. Right. In you go. Treasure. Yes, folks, another one. Roadside lamp. A few little bits in here still. Cool folks, look at that. It is a mini spot lamp. Get clicking folks. Right folks, I don't know if you remember, uh, I was here last week. I've got another one, it's another message in a bottle. Um, I take it as these are meant to be some kind of sacred message or something. So, good luck to you baby and get back out there because that's where you belong right in the bottom of that water uh, ooh black bump stereo <laughs> cool it's getting light a bit so you can see it but there we are Glapunk Paris SQM48 Lovely bit of kit I'll stick it in Bert later once I've got mud out There we go folks, light new There we go folks, getting a few bits A um, few heavy bits Clicking well. Just moving up a touch. Let's have a tickle at this side at bridge. We haven't done much at this side.
Number 352. 8. 35218. Right here, DVLA. Cheers, guys. Right, folks. We have a, a Pioneer belt driven turntable. Get in there. On them wheels of Tommy Steel. <laughs> There we go, folks. Really old pen knife there. Nice little scooter there, folks. Back wheels locked up, so I'm afraid it's it's not a rider. Although I could skid it in if you want, folks. Look, oh, it is a rider. It's going, and we're off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, brilliant. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> guy talking to me on top of bridge, watching me. <laughs> cool. Winner. Right, folks, up you can see. Bridge one done. I'm going to move up a bit, try and look up there. I've had quite a few bits out of it. There's a few big bits still. Um, we need to get some more lads up here. But I'm going to hit the next bridge up. So, floor's clean. See you soon, folks. I don't know if you can see that plastic out there, folks. I'm going to try and whip that first. Get out of the water. But yeah, I've moved along to another bridge. Uh, just a bit further along the canal. Could be a few treats in here, folks. Because you never know, do you? Nobody ever knows. Oh, ducks just crash landed on that plastic. I'll go pull it out. Oh, ducks are stood on bank, folks, because they just touched that plastic. I think they must have thought it were a pike or something. Because they all jumped out together. There we go, folks. Leave it to there. <laughs> Get my words out properly. Leave it there to dry and it'll go with me. Someone's been here before because that's an old scaffold clip, but... I think they're two blanks, guys. So I uh, think thinks me pick the right bridge again. Let's get clicking, folks. What was that? A wee bit of mud. Look at that for an old pram wheel. There's a bloody fishing wire around it, folks. Get it in there where it needs to be. Yeah, another spanner. Eyeball, saucepan handle, bit of 
scrap, another bit of scrap, chain, scrap. Few heavy bits out there, folks. Is it coming? Is it hell? <laughs> part of the pram. Here we go folks, another lovely clamp. Oh I've had one with like an H on before. That's two I've had today folks. Oh and a bonus battery as well. We got a load of crap. Do we have a magnet on the end? Oh, no magnet. Oh, that's a rip off. Oh, TV aerial, that'll do. Cheers, mate. Just needed a new TV aerial. Found Spider-Man's bike, folks. Look. Be safe. Have a go. Yeah. And we're off. Da -da 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 -da. It's a rider! No brakes! Cool folks. We've got another rider. I can sit down in my pants cart because they're waterproof. Let's just stop that for cracking little bit of kit. Is that in it folks? That'll be in a little kid's back garden soon. Couple of knives there, guys. Not pretty much though, are we? And whatever this is. Yeah, whatever. Sticky, that's what it is. Get off. Ah. It's not a ball, it's not a stick. Now then my chickens added a PC get into canal. Beautiful eh? Look at the state, it's well mangled. Floppy disk drive there guys. And DV driver, DVD driver at bottom. Yeah man, cool. Cheers whoever threw that in. Cool folks, new type, gas lamp that one. It says gas on it there, look. Grass. See you all soon, folks. Now then, folks, nearly done for the day. My scraps there. I know what that street's called, so I'm going round in a minute. I'm going to come back that way. Um, we're all clean down here, folks. Look, all of it clean, swept. Not my glove. Sick of picking up after everyone. Don't mind doing a bit. I'm not doing it all. So there you go, folks, just this bit to clean, then I'm heading that way to get my scrap. See y'all. Jesus Christ. Are we clean? We're clean, I think. We'll wipe in case. Right, I've just walked back from bridge two to bridge one and up the hill. That's the hill. That weighs a ton. I almost couldn't pull it up the hill, guys, but I got there in the end anyway. A bit more pick up, then that's me for today. See y'all soon. Right, folks, there's the plastic sheet that I brought back. Like I said, let it dry, and then I shoved it in the car. I didn't put it in the council bin, because it wasn't their rubbish. <coughs> so we'll start with the cat's eye. Um, we've had a couple of them in this location that we chose again. Scaff bar. 
sash window weights one two three of and then another weight of some description two rings or plates and that's a metal pick at the back there and then we've got a little rebar curly one brake caliper really old bike fork scooter lovely little scooter and we have a DVLA clamp street sign house plate I think that is to keep the houses uh, joists in place upstairs then we have a pioneer turntable we've got one of them wheels and I think these are the same uh, they look the same, the same kind of material, about 1960s, I think they are. Then, I've got this at back here, folks. I don't know what it is. Can anyone give me a clue? That's that bit. I don't even know which way to show it to you. Uh, there's the back of it. I take it that's the top, because that's got the key in. But obviously the key's been taken out. <laughs> Is that a steering mechanism or something? I don't know, because I'm not familiar with that. Two oil filters. I don't know what on earth that is. It's got an oil in the middle. It's got like lugs here. It's got a rim round top, but not round bottom. If anyone can tell me what that is, give us a comment in uh, down below. Uh, just leave us a message. I'll, uh, then we have that, which is off of a telegraph post, I think. There we go. That was huge. That was pulled by the 220 from one side to the other. It weighs 15 kilo straight. That's an eight old dunk of metal. Twenty-seven scaffolding clips, metal bar, more metal bars, and that's a drain cover, uh, bicycle rim, loads of uh, bits and pieces. Quite a lot of these. I'm sure I were near a car yard somewhere uh, because, as you'll see in a minute, we've got a lot of tools. Uh, I managed to pull out. A fish tank pump, yeah, that'll really help it. Can I water it? And then a bicycle pump as well. Squirt, squirt. Old mud guard, bolt, tap shoe, folks. Yep, olden. Are they cake tins or something? <laughs> and then we've got that, which is an old factory. It's got a, there's got to have been a factory there at some point. It's an old factory doorway to close the massive doors in factories. So, there's all that. And there's even more of that. And I filled a massive bin liner full of rubbish. It's in my bin. Not, I won't bother showing you it. Right, oh, nearly fell over around here. That. His windings from inside some kind of gear, but motor even. Then we've got one, two, three lamps again. I keep, but look, there's loads. <laughs> um, that one's an old British gas one, I think, because it says gas on the bottom. It's steel construction, all of it, but battery. So that's a new shape one that I hadn't had before. Two normal rectangular ones. One of these, um, I had some of these at the same location last week. And they're like, I don't know, I can only describe them as mini purses that are sewn up. Oh, faithful. Look at that. <laughs> nice lamp there. Then we've got down here, and just get in a minute. We've got this really, I don't know if it's meant to be that shaped, but it's got a really heavy hammerhead. So, that's that one. Couple of drill bits. Socket, socket, socket. Is that a piston? I think it is, you know. Pair of pliers. A working adjustable spanner. 
another spanner, screwdriver, knife, which is a kitchen knife, electrical screwdriver, lump hammer, forks, spoons. We have these, I don't know what they are guys. Is it a kickstart off something? I'm not sure. I'll show you in my hand so you can see roughly the size of it. There's that one and then a smaller one as well. And here we have some a little something for the ladies. Elizabeth Arden. Makeup set. In fact, it could be for boys as well if you're into that kind of thing. If anyone is, let me know in comments, won't you? Lovely shade of uh Yeah, that. <laughs> oh I've wiped on my frigging pants now. <laughs> right, I've got a pair of snips here. Really weird old spanners, all of them. I'm gonna clean them all, see if there's any markings on any of them. Because these are old babies, these. I like these. Little projects I've got going. I love it when raw iron comes up really nice. So let's get them in cleaning solution. Now I don't know what that is, but it's got some kind of pattern on this end here, as you can see if I can point my finger to it. There. It might be a gate latch, I'm not sure, but we'll find out. Then we have a dog chain and some beads. And they are on top of my Blapunt stereo. Blapunt, remember them folks? Alt Rage back in the 80s. Then we've got a bicycle chain and a lock, and it's been proper mangled. Someone's been on that and obviously snapped it off at some point. A few rov roving pennies. <laughs> right, another one. Look, I keep finding these and they're like, I'm not sure if they're old or if you made them yourselves or what. So, over here we have a chopper. <laughs> it's a beauty, is that? It's a really heavy one. Quality one by the look of it. I'm going to Google the name. Cassette. Wow. Does anyone remember using a pencil to fast forward it? Because I did. We've <laughs> got an old pen knife, another blade, another blade. We have a phone case marked A. I think that's an old Blackberry, but it's well gone, obviously. We've got a Nokia basher. We've got a, a weighing scale. For weighing stuff, folks. I wonder what you'd be weighing with that. Then I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine locks. Five of them all together. A lot of keys. We have uh, Duracell batteries. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six lows. Pennies galore. That's a bobbin off of a sewing machine. My coffee. I'm having that in a minute, folks. And we've got down here, let me pick it up. That's a Ford Orion. Can you see it, folks? Ford Orion. Another key ring. Now these are the bullets. If you can have a look at the top of one. I don't know how good you'll get that because I don't want to get too close and go out of focus but they're both blanks so they're quite fine and then we have a Taxon Illuminator it says it's water resistant so I'm going to stick it in a bag of rice folks yep a bag of rice and finally we have today's best prize which is a goldy looking watch it says love on it Oh, ain't that sweet? Don't forget, folks, show me your love. Click subscribe, click share, click like, click B12, because that's what Two Sugars Coffee is in coffee machine. See you all soon, folks. Happy clicking out there.